Hi, I'm Nada with Smoking Cigar Girl, and today I'm going to be reviewing the La Flor Dominicana Double Lajera Maduro Chisel. This is a 6x54 cigar with a Connecticut Broadleaf Maduro wrapper and Dominican binder and filler. There's a double dose of Lajero and the binder and filler, hence the name Double Lajero. The cigar uh, has a slightly mottled appearance, uh, a little bit uh, dry looking wrapper. The uh, foot of the cigar has a slight uh, earthy and hay aroma. Uh, as you may have noticed, this is a chisel tip cigar. Uh, if you've never seen one of these uh, before, it's a uh, special tip that is patented by La Flor Dominicana. There are several ways you can uh, cut this tip. One is to simply pinch it open and break off the cap. Uh, you actually get a pretty decent draw that way. Uh, another way I've seen people smoke this cigar is to punch the top and or bottom of the chisel. And the final way, which is what I'm going to do, is to actually cut the tip. And the reason I do this is because personally I get a better draw that way. The first few puffs of this cigar uh, have a slight spice and uh, a little bit of wood flavor as well. I'll be back in a few minutes to discuss the first third of this cigar. The first third of this cigar has had mostly leathery flavors with hints of spices and wood on the front of the palate. The finish has been mostly woodsy with hints of black pepper. The draw has been great so far and the ash is holding on steady and the burn is mostly even. The second third of this cigar has some slightly sweet flavors mixed with coffee and uh, more spices on the front of the palate. The finish continues to be mostly woodsy with hints of black pepper. The draw continues to be excellent and the burn is mostly even. The final third of this La Flor Dominicana Double Lajera Maduro Chisel has been mostly peppery on the front of the palate, with a little bit of earthiness. The finish has been mostly peppery as well, with a little bit of woodsiness. The cigar has continued to draw excellently throughout the whole smoke, and the burn is mostly even at the end now. The ash has uh, cooperated throughout the whole smoke, has, hasn't dropped on me, I've been able to tap it out at my leisure. The cigar is a medium to full bodied cigar and a medium to full strength cigar as well. Probably a good after dinner smoke or one of the last smokes of the evening. If you have any comments on this uh, review, I'd love to hear from you. And if there's anything you'd like to see me review in the future, I'd love to hear from you as well.